They got Bain. They got John Morant. They have a lot of talent. They gotta go big. They gotta go big. They gotta go big. Well, big. well let's Literally see if they do. Big. Like a big player because on the inside. The pick is in. Let's head back to NBA Commissioner Adam Silver. With the ninth pick in the 2024 NBA Draft, the Memphis Grizzlies select Zach Eady from Toronto and Purdue University. Wow. Andrea, you said go big, and they did, because Zach what Eady, I meant. born in Toronto, <laughs> Ontario, where he played hockey and baseball. He started playing basketball his sophomore year of high school, and then he later attended IMG Academy in Florida. And then after two years at IMG, he announced his decision to attend Purdue. He became a two-time AP Player of the Year and has become one of the most decorated college basketball players of all time. At the NBA Combine, you can see the legends that he joined here with that two-time player of the year nod but at the combine his measurements came out ready for this rich seven three and three quarters weighed in at 299 pounds his size is a rarity in the nba these days but how will his game translate i think it's been the question over and over again for zach edy jack zach edy isn't just big he's massive just absolutely massive he's a physical force in the paint big powerful inside presence with a 7-10 wingspan. His footwork has improved immeasurably from when he came out of high school as an unranked player. He's only been playing basketball for about six years, but he's got really good hands. Amazing. He's got an excellent touch with both his right and left hand around the basket, keeps it high, rebounds at a really high level. Last year, he averaged 25 points, over 12 rebounds a game, over five offensive rebounds. Gets fouled, goes to the free throw line, and knocks his free throws down. But the fact that his footwork and mobility has improved so much over the last several years, I think his game is going to translate to the NBA is he going to be a guy that's going to be a stretch big no but he's going to change your rotation when he's put into the game because of his size when well, what I love about his numbers is that every year he got better yep. every year he improved that's what NBA players and NBA teams want to see when you look at their team when you talk about Jaron Jackson Jr defensive player of the year just a couple of years ago now you're adding a big Steven Adams when he was out there was a big hole in what they were trying to accomplish yeah so now all of a sudden you have another big Jaron Jackson Jr. You got Bain. You got John Morant. You got Marcus Smart. This is a team that, if they can see healthy, will be a force next year in the Western Conference.